Hello, it's Ellie Tento, and today I am checking up on my pet Alter. He has been in hibernation, and we are going to see how they are doing and also what's been going on on my island. So let's get straight into the video. Oh, I've emerged from a little tent. I forgot I've got this uh, tent area. Let's have a check of the uh, old nook miles. Blimey, I've got a lot to claim. Right, let's claim more of these. 300 for this. Let's see how many more I've got. Another 300. God, there's so many of them. Let's get all the uh, nookie points. Okay, it definitely seems like- oh, even more of them! It definitely seems like I've got the threshold now to upgrade to a house. Oh, gotta keep claiming all of these. Might even have enough space to uh, claim some extra pocket space which would be very handy. Didn't realise I've been quite this busy! Looks like I've completed it twice over! <laughs> We done? No! Still going! Almost at 10,000 now, we've doubled our point count. Yep, we have definitely doubled it. So many! Seriously? I did not think it would take this long. Uh, <laughs> we done yet? Nope. Apparently not. Still claiming, still claiming. So I've gained 10,000 points. Okay, that's a lot of achievements. Well, safe to say I can definitely upgrade to a house now. Uh, I suppose we might as well uh, go ahead and just do that. Let's upgrade this uh, area to a proper house. Getting a bit sick of my uh, cute little pet living in a tent, to be honest. Need some more space, so uh, let's go ahead and pay this uh, tent off. It's long overdue. Right, here we are. Customization workshop? I'm really not interested in Nook. Leave me alone. <laughs> Yeah, excuse me, I just want to pay off the mortgage. Right. The ABD, I believe I've got to go to... Oh, no. Apparently not. Right, no, I just want to pay the house off. My moving fees, yes. Yeah, but, but take them, please. That is 5,000 miles and not a mile less. Thank you. This is happy day for both of us. Your fees are clear. What could be better? Oh. It could be a lot better. Because they're profitable, of course. Tom the crook. Yeah, a proper home, please. Costs. Yeah, I know. I've got plenty of points, thank you. Just... You gonna give me a house then? You gonna let me have a house? I found my home. Yes, I want to live in a proper house. I am fine with that because my account has more than enough bells, so let's please do it. Eight different colours for the roof. Hmm. Well, I am an otter. I suppose a brown roof would be most appropriate. Does it have blue? Seriously, is it not coming up? Hold on. Red, pink, yellow, black. Blue, aqua, green or purple. Really? There's no brown? That's surprising. Uh, I suppose yellow then? Oh, and apparently I'm getting an upgrade as well. Well, thanks, I don't really care about the Nook Mar Plus, but thanks anyway, Nook. 
I just want to see my home, please. In fact, you know what? Yeah, I just want to go. The home area is all looking well and good, but I think it could definitely improve. And I've got a few things I can craft, so uh, let's go to the crafting table. And I want to use some uh, junk material, so first off, let's make some shoes. Thank you for all that fishing. Got some lovely recycle boots now, which is awesome. And there's one other thing I'd also like to make. So, I believe, here we are, a tyre toy, a little tyre seat. So let's use that one tyre I've got. Fix that up. And we've got ourselves a little seat. Now I can finally have somewhere to properly sit down on. So uh, let's put that down. Oh, that's looking lovely. You can just sit here, relax, and uh, pretty much just enjoy everything. So adorable. Anyway, now that I pay that mortgage off, I will see you in a little bit when I uh, upgrade. And here we are, we finally have our little house. Isn't that adorable? Oh, and it looks like I've got some mail as well. I'm not even sure if I've got the space for this. I will try. Let's see. Okay, let me take it. I'm going to have to probably drop these items though, because, yep, my pockets are absolutely full to the brim, so... We'll drop that recipe and we will also drop those candles. Right, first things first, before I pick up any more furniture to move into my house, let's see the upgrades. Okay, so we are inside. Congratulations on your new home. Here are a few tips for comfortable living. Turn the lights, entering mode, and opening storage. I know this lights on and off. Entering decorating mode, opening storage. Sorted. So let's tidy this up because this is an absolute mess at the moment. In fact, you know what? I'm not even sure I want a lot of this stuff, so I'm going to put a lot of it in the storage, I'll be honest. Let's have a look. What else? Put that away. I think that's pretty decent. Now let's check on the uh, wallpapers. So there's Marine Pop and Imperial. Okay. Now what about the floorings? Cool paint flooring and blue honeycomb tile, okay. So I believe, so imperial wall for sure. Let's put that on. That looks great. Now I'm not sure which one the flooring is gonna be. I think it could be either or. Let's uh, try them. Oh, apparently my pockets are full. It doesn't seem to like that. Well, something else I'll also try to do is uh, put some more stuff in my storage because I have way too many items on me, so. Let's put all of that away. Okay, that's making my space a lot better now. So let's pick these up. We can put those in the storage as well. Let's see how the blue honey comb looks. Actually, that looks really good. Now let's compare it to the uh, cool paint flooring. Okay, that doesn't quite look right. Okay, so it looks pretty cool like this. I am curious, though, how it will look with the... Uh, other wallpaper so uh got to organize my pockets a bit better so let's put the marine pop and the cool paint flooring down hmm okay so that does look a lot more homely i'd say let's try the other one again hmm a lot more temple like i th it's nice but i think i prefer the other one as it's just that little bit more homely so let's put that on and save the others Okay, so that's great. This is going really well. I'm not sure if I want to use those yet. I'm going to put all this away. Okay, and it's looking a lot cleaner already. There is one problem though. Uh, I don't have the furniture I actually want, so i got to go back and uh, collect some bits real quick. So we're back at my player's house and I've got a, just about everything to decorate it with. It took a long time for me to uh, find these items but uh, let's get to it. Okay let me just turn that off a second. So as you guys can see this house here is looking pretty bare. That's why I've got all my furniture with me. First things first though I'm going to put all this in storage because I'm not sure if I'm going to need this so bye bye to all the furniture. And we have a pretty blank canvas to work with here. 
So that's all the furniture I've got in storage. It's a lot here. But I'm trying to use all the stuff that I've got in my pocket. So first things first. Let's put down some really big items because that's definitely going to help. So got ourselves a little bathtub. It is a necessity for otters. And we got ourselves a hose reel as well. So that is an excellent job there. We also have a little slide because they got to play too. Now the thing I'm being mindful of is uh, walking space. I'm trying to make it as well done as possible. So you know what? I might put that right next to where the bath is actually. Nice little sh L shape here. Now we also have, I keep pressing the wrong button. It's a force of habit. So we got some cooking stuff, toy box. Ah, a hammock, yes, so the hammock is very important. Um, let's put that here for now. We do also have some uh, plants to decorate with, so that'll be nice. So got a plant here, and actually a space heater. Okay, that is looking really cute, that corner. Let's see what else we uh, have. Some grass, some holy socks. Ah, we do need a good stereo. That'll be very useful. I keep pressing the wrong button, I really need to stop doing that. Again, got a lot of toys here actually, we're going to have to see if it's going to fit. Right, let's get the ironwood desk here, yes, that's very helpful. So where could, actually I think that might be better in the other corner, having the uh, all the cooking stuff, that would make much more sense. And of course I'm bearing in mind, if I was to add an extra room, we're going to need a gap here. So uh, there's the little cooker, and let's put the uh, little rice cooker and resolve revolving rack as well here. Lovely. It also gives me a chance to put some stuff on the wall which will be very helpful so let's try and find it. World map? Nope. Pot rack. That's the one I'm trying to find. That's great. And while I'm here I could actually put the map here too because I feel like it would be really good here. Okay so it's definitely coming along together. Actually I think the stereo right here in the middle is per because it just makes the most sense and we have one more thing to stick on the wall which is an ornament mobile so that's great and actually it also gives me a great chance to put more of the toys here as well so let's have a look at what we got left doll's house okay gotta have the big toy box here that just makes the most sense really actually that's a great spot I really need to stop pressing the wrong button, that would definitely help me. Hmm, actually I'm not sure the doll's house fits in here too well, let's uh, go through the other toys I got. So, we've got a doll, a ball, and cat grass. We'll definitely put the ball down, that will definitely do a nice job here. And I suppose the doll's house could go next to it, that doesn't look too bad actually. Let's see, any other items to use? So we've got a doll and some cat grass. Actually, if we put the doll here for decoration, then we can also put the gap grass. Okay, that looks really good like that, actually. Now let's have a quick wander to see how it's looking. Okay, that's looking really cute, actually. And there's a good amount of walking space, which is also very helpful. Let's have a closer look. Hmm. You know what? I might move the slide, actually. Would that look better here? It looks interesting like that. Now we do have some music, so let's put this on. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. Actually, I think I might have underdone that. Okay, that's quite nice. Is that all the furniture? I think so. Oh no, it looks like we have two holy socks to put down, so let's just quickly put that near here. So I think this will be a good spot here, and maybe one on the door? Actually, that looks really good like that. Just a little bit of decoration. I gotta admit, the walls are a little bit bare though, so let's see in my storage if there's anything else we can put down. So, okay, we've got some t shirts, some decorative t shirts. That looks really cute. Let's see. I could put one here, maybe one here too. Ah, actually, this wall would be really good. That might be a bit low down for my liking, actually. Um. Hmm, it's not the easiest things to place down the t-shirts. Okay, that's looking a lot better. We do have a lot more uh, items in the storage though. Let's have a look and see. 
There is a shell table, but that looks really big. I'm not even sure that's going to fit in this house, to be honest. Although we do also have a lecture hall desk, which could hold some items. I'm just seeing if there's anything else we could put down. Oh, the confetti machine, of course. Gotta have the confetti machine. Just thinking where a great place would be. Ah, actually that works really well. And we've also got a little festival light as well. That would also be really good. Oh, actually the socks get in the way, so... See, we can't get into the hammock now. That's not very clever of me now, is it? See, this is a problem sometimes when you have just too many bits of furniture. It's not ideal. It's not ideal at all. See, I'm not sure of having that uh, extra festival lamp looks right. Unless we had it behind the bath, that could work actually. Okay, that looks a lot better. Now let's have another look at the items we've got here. More wall decorations, although I don't want to overdo it. There's some fish rugs, again, I don't want to overdo the decorations. Um, I think, actually, we've done pretty well here. So let's have another quick walk around. Yeah, this looks like a really cute front room. And let's put the confetti machine on, eh? It's like a really adorable playground here. Got some stuff to make some rice with. Got some nice music. And we can relax in this cute little hammock. I am really chuffed with how this uh, house is looking. Very satisfied. Definitely looks a lot more like an otter's lair now. I'm so pleased. After a few minor tweaks, this is it. So this is my otter's new halt. So as you can see, definitely an improvement from the tent. So I've got a little bath over here. Oh, my character's looking at the camera. Sorry about that. So we have a little bath here full of hose pipe. Got a little confetti machine with green confetti, which is adorable. Got some uh, grass to play with. Got a tambourine, which... Oh, of course I got to go back. Get to play like crazy, which is really funny. Let's get rid of that a second. Okay, it's pretty properly. Got a cute little doll, a little doll's house. Got a ball as well that we can play with. Got a whole bunch of toys, which is adorable. We have our own cot as well, which is lovely to sleep in. Very comfortable. And right at the back, we've got a little music player and a little kitchen as well. So we've got all the necessities. I am really impressed with how this room looks. Well, after all of that, I think we're nearly done. There's just one final touch we need to do. There we are, that looks wonderful. And I am just going to take a lovely little seat here and uh, just relax for a bit. So, uh, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe and to put a comment down below. And also to like this video too. If you want to see more Animal Crossing videos like this, the playlist is about to appear on the screen right now. I hope you've enjoyed my uh, little journey with uh, one of my alt accounts. Because I've already completed Animal Crossing, I've been making these alt accounts to have some more enjoyment. As I've completed so much of it on my first account, the only way to enhance the experience is by having multiples. So as you can see here, it's just brought an extra challenge to my game. Anyway, thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you all next time.